there's a powerful passage from the alchemist and the boy tells the alchemist i fear that my heart will have to suffer and the alchemist tells the boy tell your heart that the fear of suffering is worse than the suffering itself and that no heart ever suffers when going in search of its dreams this is such a powerful passage because it explains that the fear that we all have in our minds in some way or another is often much worse than the actual experience of that fear. So imagine we're feeling, we're fearing failure. Our, feel the, our fear of failure is what prevents us from stepping forward and achieving our goal or stepping into our dream. However, if we actually just failed, it might not be so bad. Yet our fear of that failure being much worse than it actually would be is what prevents us from stepping forward and taking that leap of faith. This is something in psychology called catastrophizing, where we blow up a thought or a possible fear to such an extent that it prevents us from moving forward and where we think it's so much worse than it actually would be. This was also practiced by the ancient Stoics, who some of these kings one day a week or a month would practice eating really poor and living like the homeless. And what this did was that it allowed them to understand that their worst fear, if it did come true for whatever reason, that they would still be able to move forward, that life would go on and it wouldn't be as bad as they thought it would. But by experiencing it and understanding that this is the worst that could happen, it allowed them to step past that block in their head of that fear and move forward and keep charging. So is there something in your life where you're, you're telling yourself, I want to do something, but, and that but is the fear. It's this, it's this irrational block in your head that's paralyzing you from moving forward. Ask yourself, am I suffering from the fear of this? Or what, if this actually happened, what would it feel like? What would it look like? And when we can understand the worst thing that could happen and say, you know what, my life will go on, you know what, things will work out, then we are free to move forward and achieve our dreams and accomplish our goals. In the process, like the alchemist told the boy, of stepping into your dreams and in the pursuit, you will not suffer because you're pursuing your true calling and there's no greater feeling than that and you will not suffer in that. So what are you telling yourself that you can't do because of the fear and how will you move past it? Thank you guys for checking out my videos. You can subscribe at YouTube. You can subscribe to my blog. Every Wednesday, a new post, inspiration, motivation. Step into your greatness. I love you guys. Thank you, and have an amazing day.